Hey guys, and welcome back to Deep Fear. So, when we last left off, we were exploring, and we were, I wouldn't say we're stuck, we just haven't found where to go yet. Does that count as stuck? Maybe. <clears throat> so, anyway, um, I'm pretty sure out of all these options and uh, areas to go that was the emergency pool we I'm pretty sure we're gonna have to go through the storage room there has to be uh, a door or something that we haven't gone through because we do need well there is a um, door in the junk room that we haven't been through I'm thinking about it you know, it makes sense that a uh, spare IC chip might, might be in the junk room. But we just need to find a key card. That is the problem. We need to find somewhere where there's a key card. Uh, oh, hang on. Have we been Have we been up both of those elevators? Uh Hmm. I'm not sure. Uh, da, 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 da. Right. Well, we're not going to worry about it too much um so we can go up there up just leads to that's the lab laboratory and that's gina's room right so we've been everywhere here there isn't actually any rooms that we haven't explored so i wonder in that case let's go back through the storage room <clears throat> so is there a lift that we haven't been up yet? I guess we're going to go find out. I mean, deactivating these lasers, I don't really think has done a whole lot for us. Do we need to refill our ammo? A little bit. No, we don't. Okay. Yeah, so... What was where was the other elevator then? I'm curious. So we've got this one down here, which I wish it told us where we actually were on the map. So that we've obviously yeah, so we've come straight ahead. So that's that one. Okay, so what was this way? Because <clears throat> we came in... Right, that's... Oh, okay, so that's to the junk area. Right, got you. So... The junk area is red, and I'm assuming the junk area elevator is red because it sets us off to a different area. Does that make sense? Second floor... Yeah, because there's no point going to the second floor, is there? Is there any? Ah. Hmm. There's obviously something we've missed here. There's nothing in the junk room that we've missed. Right, one second, guys. I am going to go have a little run round and see what I can find. Really? Oh, I was bitten by a mouse that came out of the ventilation and got sick. What do you want? I want to repair the air system. I just threw away the old IC in the junk area. Do you have it? Yes, it's the ammo tape. Here. I'll be right back. Don't move. No way. Not even at gunpoint. There are creatures all over the place out there. 
Yeah, uh, I'm pretty sure he's going to turn into like a giant mutant. Okay, so after all that, after all that running around, uh, I you just had to go back and talk to him again. Um, I mean, I guess that makes sense, I suppose. So we've got to go back to the junk room. Cool. Now, I did manage to clear a way uh, through those weird jumping dog things. I managed to shoot them all. Um, <coughs> you'll never guess. I went back into that room. I guess when you leave a room, enemies don't get their health back, which is actually quite cool. Now, I put one bullet into each of those dogs, and it was enough to kill them. So, profit? Okay. Now, we have to go all the way back to the junk area, which isn't actually that far away, admittedly, but come on. Dude. Oh. Okay. We have more yippy, jumpy, bouncy, bloody dogs. Well, apparently, we're shooting something. Okay, changing the mag. Is it dead? I guess not. Yeah, or maybe it is. Okay, I'm guessing... Yeah, right. There we go. At least I could show you that much, I suppose. So, yeah, you can kill them. And I probably should have refilled my air on the way back through that room. Bad planning on my point. But, hey, it's hardly the first time I've had some... Oh, actually, it's not... Oh. Let's go load up on everything whilst we're here. Oh, right. Now, back to the junk area. Although, we could take a little pit stop to the pool area first and get our oxygen refilled, which is probably a really good idea, actually. Because we're dropping down to, like, less than half oxygen left. Which is bad, I assume. Luckily, we can just go to the emergency pool. Yeah, so apparently you can't have multiple saves in the emulation on Modefin without actually programming it into the emulator yourself. And ain't nobody got time for that. Okay. Let's charge that up. And I guess take a long trip back. Although I don't think it's that far away. Trying to remember now. Seems like it's been forever since we've been back there. Oh, great. These bloody dogs are out here as well. Uh, that's awkward. Right, well. I'm not going to fight these dogs. I failed to see a reason. And that's the wrong way, isn't it? Yeah. Alright. Maybe we will fight the dogs. Or maybe we won't. These enemies, or at least there only appears to be one that's probably going to kill us. So I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to switch up to that. And we're going to eat some of these. Where is that bastard dog thing? I really don't want this thing chewing my asshole. Oh, man. Yeah, this SMG, man. This SMG is really bad. Like, really bad. I'm hoping... Can it even kill this? I guess it can. It just takes half of the ammo. Is it? This SMG... Is awful. Absolutely awful. I think we will be better off with the Glock. Definitely. Right, let's go back to the junk area. Let's go!
There's a lot of um, full motion video in this game, which is really cool. A bit of a sucker for that old grainy full motion video. Not going to lie. Now, if memory serves, it's in here. And it's... Ooh, which one? Okay, I half expected that monster to be back in here, actually. But it looks like we're good. Uh, try and remember now. We're in there. We want to go down. So, we're going to go to this one. And I am out of coffee. What a travesty. Absolute bastards. Out of coffee. It's not acceptable. How can you fight monsters without that delicious, delicious brown bean? Oh, oh god damn it. Gonna have to go make more. Oh good, more of these bloody dog things. Great. You know, I don't think it's worth fighting these things. Oh, and I put the gun away. Uh, charge. Charge that. Do you want to save the game? Maybe. Possibly. I guess. Uh, there. Yeah, sure. All right, we're going to get hit, aren't we? Nope, we're good. We're good. Run. Run like you've never run before. There we go. Ah, uh, good lord. Yeah, I don't like those things. And the aiming system isn't as refined as it was on Resident Evil. When you, on Resident Evil, if you push the aim button and you locked onto an enemy, you hit the enemy. In this, it's a bit more um, of a crapshoot. Oh! Well, that, that was easy. I guess it's literally just there. Okay. Anything going to jump out at us? No? Oh, all right. Okay, then. Sure. So, we literally got sent all the way back to pick up a chip that's... Right, okay. Okay, game, sure. If that's how you want to play it, that's how we'll play it. That, I mean, seriously? Why? Oh. I mean, yeah, cool. That was just silly to run through that little gauntlet all the way back there just to pick up a little chip. There's no, oh, well, I mean, you know, we've got this gentleman jumping out at us, which is a bit of excitement, I suppose. But they couldn't have made like a little puzzle or something to unlock it or maybe a little bit more journey a little bit more fanfare it's just open the door there's the chip okay cool sure I mean at least we did have that little fella jumping out on us also how are we open how's this water staying contained in this room as we're opening these doors Perfectly contained. Seems a little bit strange. But, you know. I guess. Who am I to ask these silly questions when there's a bacteria or virus? Well, was it a virus or bacteria? I can't even remember what she said now. Some kind of virus spreading throughout this place. It's a bit insensitive, I suppose, to be asking these kind of questions. People are dying, damn it, Titan. Do you not understand that? Game has no time for your continuity questions. Physics is a non-issue here. Uh, emergency pool, we don't need to go back there. We go straight through storage. That just seems like... I, just, I, I have to bring it up. It just seems so stupid to go all that way for a little chip. For no real reason other than just to waste a bit of time, I guess. Okay. 
I suppose we'll refill the SMG just because. I'm gonna be honest though, the Glock is a good weapon. It's got a lot of stopping power, it sounds okay, and it puts the enemies down fairly quickly. I literally don't know why you'd use the SMG. Maybe there's an upgrade for it later, maybe it gets better, not really sure. But, you know. Uh, yes, this is the one. This is the one. Then we can go get a friend, and then we can get her to use her eyeballs to open the door. Fun times. There we go. Right. It's the old IC chip. I don't know why... Seems a bit odd as well. That um, we've used the old IC chip. Why did they take the old IC chip out? Am I missing something? I'm probably missing something. Okay. So now, in theory, we should be able to go get her. And she'll be like, hey, let's go. Let's go on an adventure to find the monkey. Well, I can't even think what his name was now. The Space Monkey. Uh, okay, she was... Ah, let's go see our friend before we do that. I wonder if he's horribly transformed into a mutant. Probably. Oh, no horrible, squelchy, gooey sounds. So, you're right there, dude. I feel cold. I think I'll take the day off tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, you do that. Uh, you know, you know what, bud? Just go home now. It's fine. Call it a day. Go home. Have a sleep. One thing I do like is as you're progressing, I like the way that these survivors seem to actually deteriorate. It's kind of cool. Especially when you think of when this game came out. Very cool. I mean, I know I'm taking the piss out of this game quite a bit. Because, you know, it's funny. But it's genuinely a pretty fun game. It's definitely... Well, I don't want to say it's up there with Resident Evil. But it's not bad. It's pretty consistent with what else was out there at the time, I guess. Right. Come on, you. The system is running. Please help me release the net lock. Before that, I found two more things about the parasite cell. What? I didn't find a parasite cell in your blood. Well, that's but I good. I did find a coli virus and gave it to a mouse. The virus kept the parasite away. A solution. Not necessarily. It just means that the parasite cell does not enter bodies infected with a virus. The virus alone cannot fend off the parasite cell. Oh. But there's one more important find. The parasite cell is weak in oxygen. Oxygen? For most animals, oxygen is actually lethal. Because of the low level, humans can live on Earth. This parasite cell has a lower oxygen tolerance than humans, so even the oxygen in the air weakens them. That means... If you fill the big table with a lot of air, then the parasite cell should weaken. Let's go release the net lock. Hmm, okay. I like the fact that it's not just, oh, zombies again. Also, she seems to have a limit of oxygen in her room. Uh, which we didn't have before. Not really sure how this oxygen system works, because sometimes you have unlimited air and sometimes you don't. In fact, repairing that IC chip has seemed to have made it worse. <laughs> this area had unlimited air in it before. Now it doesn't. Okay. Not that I'm trying to find holes in the game, of course. Should we kill this guy? Let's kill this guy. Come on, dude. 
it up so I can kill you again. I'll allow you to die like a warrior. Well, I mean, kind of anyway, I suppose. Right, let's go. Well, let's go. Go down the ladder. Aye, I guess. I suppose, what else would you do with the ladder? Well, you know, I suppose you might go up here. It's one other thing you do with the ladder, I suppose. Uh, okay. So, yes, we want to go around here. Hey, there she is. Hopefully she doesn't get horribly murdered by the guy that's in that room. Retina retrieval. Oh, those scan lines. Those scan lines. It's okay now. You should be able to go through at any time. What about you? I'll stay here a little more. I'll notify you when I found the creature's weak points. But there's no uh Be careful. John. Thanks for everything. You're welcome, Doctor. Call me Gina. Okay. Alright guys. Because there's a man and a woman doesn't mean they have to exchange bodily fluids. Although, it probably would be good here. You know, give her the virus so she wouldn't die. Or at least it would protect her slightly. <clears throat> or maybe she just doesn't care about getting the virus herself. Hey, our friend has mutated. There we go. You're right there, friend. Yeah, I thought I'd come in here to finish you off. Seemed rather heartless to just leave you here to, you know, do whatever it is that you were doing by yourself. Hey, look on the bright side, dude. You got tomorrow off now. Right. Actually, do you have anything on you? I do like the way they uh, uh, mutate over time. It's really cool. Right, so let's go through our new door. Excitement. Oh, hello. The hell is that? Can we kill it? I think we can kill it. Oh. Some little floor critter. Hello, dude. I don't know what's going on. Are we winning, son? Uh, uh, that sounded like a different squeak. Okay, we got it. I think that well, that was new. Well, I guess if it bleeds, we can kill it. Right, go to the apartment area. Yeah, it seems like a reasonable thing to do. <clears throat> Ooh. What's that? Ooh. It's a snake. Ooh. Are you okay? Oh, yeah. Thanks for saving me. Who are you? Wouldn't it be polite if you told me your name first? She definitely works out. 
rescue squad. How do I know you're not a creature? <laughs> I could ask you the same question. I'm coming down. Sus, very sus. Do I look like a monster? Ah. Uh. <laughs> In a way, yes. <laughs> Nice, John. <laughs> I'm Anna Lawrenson, the in company diver. What are you doing here? Returning to the CCD area. The area lock is broken. It can't be repaired, but there is a way in. How? Easy. Torch the area lock panel and rewire it. Where can I find a torch? Find it yourself. I'm busy looking for Rambo. Rambo? What? Rambo. A bulldog. My companion. I usually let him roam around here. If something happens, he usually returns right away. But in these conditions, I'm worried. So, I don't have time to talk. Bye. Ah, uh, there's so many things wrong with that, but okay. Cool. Right, well, I mean, sure. So, Annabelle, she, her, her name was? She... Kind of looks like she would bend John's spine like a balloon animal. Um, and she's looking for her dog, who definitely is not infected by some horrible mutant thing. A small park. There's no need to go in. Oh, I beg to differ. Hey, look, if Chris Redfield himself can uh, take a little bit of time out and go on the, the swings and the slide in Resident Evil 4. Uh, no, Resident Evil 6. Uh, I think we can have a little bit of playtime. Okay, so what have we got going on here? Uh, oh, right, so that's the lift. Okay. We'll leave the lift for now. So what's in here? A kiosk. What the devil is in the kiosk? Oh, monsters. Oh, my. I guess. I guess there's always monsters. Uh oh. Be nice if we could manually reload. But. I don't think we can. So the kiosk is a shop. Any more of you bastards in here? Oh, hello. What do we have here? Ooh. Magazines for submachine gun. Um, okay, I suppose. I mean, submachine gun's kind of stinky, but sure. Anything else in here? Anything at all? Put the mask on, John. Ooh. That was, yeah, that's the way in. There's literally only one way in. You don't get, like, a chicken leg <laughs> hamburger, I guess. All right. Do we do? They're out of hamburgers. They had one hamburger left. But all these bloody monsters ate the lot, didn't they? Why do I get the feeling that we need uh, that hamburger for the dog? It's a double cheeseburger. Boy, does it make me hungry. Uh, okay, so we can't actually set it. I think. Uh, well, I'm guessing we need that for something. So, let's not just gan it the bloody thing right down. Good way to get indigestion, goddammit. <clears throat> okay. So, we've got ourselves a hamburger. Ah, medical room. Nice. Definitely want to have a little peek in the medical room. So, what? Oh, hello. Uh, I'll be with you in a minute. Ah, oh, unlucky. Uh, air grenades. I can, you know, these air grenades and whatnot, they're not exactly rare, are they? Which is interesting. I, I kind of thought they would be. In fact, supplies in general. Uh, bulletin board says, be careful not to catch a gold. Well, too late for that. In fact, it's kind of saving us at the moment. 
Um, yeah, in fact, it's kind of difficult to ooh, run out of any kind of supplies. Whoa, more submachine gun ammo? Seriously? Well, I mean, kind of. The ability to hold submachine gun ammo, and that looks like a ladder, but we can't do anything with it. All right, that's enough overlooking the elephant in the room. You right there, dude? I feel so cold. The medicine isn't working. There should be some ammo around here. Kill the monsters out there with them. Uh, yeah. Come fetch me later. I'll be here. Yeah, I mean, I don't doubt it. I'm uh, sure you will be there, sir. However, your form will be different. Just, just saying. Uh, now. So, I guess we're taking the elevator. So we know the red box room thing is to another area. Okay, I'm starting to learn the, the ins and the outs of this map, which is good. Uh, but anyway, guys, that's basically all we have time for right now, because we're on 31 minutes. Again, I know. The time is going so quickly with this game. It's a shame, because I'm loving it. Right, I'm going to drop a save here, guys, because God knows when we're actually going to find a proper save machine. I guess. Not that far away. But... When we come back, we're going to hit up the elevator. We're going to pick a floor at random. I suppose we work our way up or down, whichever. Um, unless we're on the middle floor. Then things get slightly more interesting. Anyway, till next time, guys. Thanks for watching.